What is up fellow Benchwarmers? Welcome to another episode of Fantasy Benchwarmers and of course like always like every Saturday this is the weekly episode. Actually this is the uh ano ba to? Parang filler episode na rin eh, kasi wala tayong quickie, di ba? Komish. Oo, week. So All Star Break. All Star Break pero ano uh like just with the ano natin tradition oh, tradition to like parang just with nakasanayan na natin we always do the weekly pa rin kahit na all star break so today it's quite interesting kasi over the past two weeks we talked about some basketball stuff NBA PBA uh gilas diba and today we'll talk about something different something na slowly picking up diba the first time i heard about this Uh, was actually naririnig ko na from some players eh particularly when I heard about uh, heard it from Tyrese Halliburton talking about it uh, hindi ko alam kung napa, napakinggan niya nakapakinggan mo ba yan Tomish? Oo oh, na, narinig ko yun yung sa wanted to buy I think body heals moment or something Oo oh, tapos parang sabi niya na late na raw siya so we are, we, we're talking about NBA top shot and Of course, kasama pa rin natin si Komish. And we have two special guests uh, yes. from one of the Top Shot groups. Hindi ko alam if it's the only Top Shot group in the Philippines, eh, no? But yes, yes. It is, okay. So, yes, it is. So, uh, so yun. Mamaya, we'll get to know more about the group and I'll let them promote it as well para maka-join in kayo dun sa group, no? Uh, so, I'd like to introduce si JC. JC Cuevas, tama and yeah. Marvin, yes. Marvin Lim. Yeah, hi. How are you guys? Doing, everyone. Jeremy, yeah. Eric. Hello. Hi, so Jeremy, so Eric. So, wag niyo na kami, sir. Hindi mo tayo nagkakalayo sa AC. <laughs> <laughs> Naa, maraming, um, interest, maraming interested sa episode natin. Na. We've been getting a lot of messages. <laughs> oh, may nag-PM sa amin. Baka <laughs> kaya nila live. Uh, <laughs> okay. Rare kami mag-live eh, kasi we, uh, mostly uh, recorded. Pero don't worry, uh, by this time, alam niyo na, pero rare yeah. kami mag-live. Anyway, so guys, uh, tanong ko lang, hindi ko natanong kanina while we were, you know, chatting a bit. You know? how, how young are you guys? Oh, I'm uh, 32 years old. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm, Martin uh, gets it. Yeah, I'm currently 31. I'm turning 32 this uh, mm, May. Okay, so many of JC and I are, uh, yeah, uh, we're classmates, no, from high school. In high school, school. yeah. Mm, yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. Kala ko, yeah, ano kayo eh. Yeah, siguro mga... Kala ko, mga nasa 20s pa lang kayo, nung pagpasok ni JC, sabi ko. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Medyo bata pa to, ha. JC kasi nagapadorma yan, eh. <laughs> Nagapabendo yan si JC, eh. <laughs> sabi ko, medyo bata pa to. Tapos... Medyo nataw pa ako kasi parang naliligaw yata itong batang to. Miguel yung nakalagay dun sa name niya. <laughs> Miguel! Sino ba Miguel na sumapas? Walang password. Walang password din. Eh. <laughs> Tapos, naisip ko, eh Marvin yung sabi ni JC na sasama. Hindi naman Miguel eh. Kaya kala ko naligaw si Miguel. Tapos sobrang bata yung itsura. Anyway guys, so how, when did you start uh, you know, getting into this top shot top shot nba top shot before natin pag-usapan what it is okay uh, actually si Marvin yung nag-introduce sa akin ng uh, nba top shot yung tulad nga ng kanina na sinabi niya na naghahanap siya ng mga long term investments since um uh, stock exchange siya so parang sinabi niya sa mga sa akin din sa classmates ko na parang para let's try to invest dito sa top shot mga around the uh, Late January, right? Yeah, yeah mm-hmm. mga late January. Yeah. Tapos from there, um, nagbigay kami ng capital sa kanya and siya na nag uh, make the moves since dun siya magaling. Mm, okay, okay. So, may ano pala, financer pala kayo ni, ni Marvin. Si Marvin ang mag invest for you guys. But you <laughs> guys created the group. Yes, I did. With my okay. uh, yeah, other yeah. friends. Okay, okay, okay. Kami actually team. So, shout out to ano, <laughs> sino ba Sir yung mga sige yang. shout out sino sino Sir Yang Sister Sir Yang Lucky. Sir Lucky Ma'am uh, Jeline yeah. Sir Eggsy 
and so, the rest of the J boys. Bakit you yeah. call them sir? Ano, like, um, I guess because we're not familiar with personally, so like a like a, okay. a, a sign of respect or ano. Ah, okay, okay. Ne, talo kasi parang you were ano, you were magkakilala na kayo and then decided to do. Uh, 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 lahat kami yung nagmeet lang online. Yeah, like sa Discord lang sa Discord mostly. For the NBA Top Shot, dahil sa NBA yes. Top Shot. Okay. Yeah, like sila sila Sir Lucky, sila Sir Eggsy. Uh, mas nauna sila sa amin. I think sila mga ano ba JC like mga October, November sila no, I would say. Yeah, mga November sila nag-start sa yeah. NBA Top Shot. But when Tapos did this sila, stop? Yeah, sige, sige, go. Sige, sige tuloy mo lang, Marvin. I, I I think mga early October ata eh. Like yung 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 resumption ng bubble. I think mm-hmm. do like start officially. Like, it's mm, a few, okay. yeah. Like, uh, I'll fact check it. Like, I'll uh, like, yeah. uh, Google it. But it's definitely, it's quite new. Like, it's yeah, yeah, like, not like, one, one year. year. It's not one year. Yeah, yeah. Pa. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, so, uh, you, Marvin, you found out about this because you were looking for investments. Yeah, like a parang alternative uh, investments, uh, no? Because yeah. you felt that the markets were too, parang ano ba? Parang ano? Del- delikado na, too high. Yeah, yeah, baka parang I think the point is parang mainstream. It's my opinion lang, ah. Like, baka, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, baka mo mis- misinterpret. I'm not giving financial or ano, yeah, uh, yeah. Well, that's my opinion lang. Baka mali ako. Yeah. So, like, yeah. You were saying, JC? So, Ah, actually yung NBA Top Shot, nasa ano pa siya, um, beta pa siya. Okay. So hindi pa siya officially launched, beta pa siya. So marami pang um, mga inaayos and yung mga bugs, issues. Yeah, yeah. Like, ngayon? Uh, yung ngayon? Yes, yes. Up yeah. to now. Kasi parang currently kasi parang sabi nila, parang uh, beta pa lang sila. So parang infancy pa lang nung uh, project, no? Yeah. So may mga bugs sila na tiyatrayan nila address. Like currently, tiyata nila address yung mga bots sa mga pack drops or sa marketplace. Mm-hmm. Like, uh, if you're familiar, like, kunyari, bibili kayo ng mga shoes online, like mga Kobe's, Yeezy's, diba? They usually release it through pack drop, or, or like through drops, diba? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Tapos no, na, like, yung one of the main issues, no, for, for yung mga legitimate collectors is yung mga bots, diba? Like, yung mga ibang resellers, yeah. parang they uh-huh. use bots para to improve their chances of winning, ano, Ah, uh, parang yung mga bots na yon, uh, may ganun din, like may mga users din who uh like uses those bots no sa mm-hmm. top shot currently. Mm-hmm. So yun yung Tetra is Tetra extinguish no. Okay. So, yung uh Dapper Labs, you management behind uh top shot. Okay. Pero, Pero just, ano, yeah, sige, Eric. let's try to ano, uh, explain muna kasi maraming listeners din ang not familiar yeah. here with what top shot is really so what yeah. is it really like for for a newcomer so someone who doesn't have any idea about it how can we explain it to them so okay um top shot is uh, an nft it's a non-fungible token ano? okay so yung mga moments or like mga highlights mm-hmm. or like videos or gifs that can be digit digitally traded no Okay. on the top shot platform no and uh yung platform na to ng top shot it's uh powered no by blockchain technology so yung dapper labs um meron silang previous na project called crypto kitties so yun yung i guess one of the first na non fungible tokens no mga 2017 tapos mm. uh, yung crypto kitties na yon was running on ethereum na platform mm-hmm. then medyo nag spike yung interest sa crypto kitties nag slow down yung whole na ethereum network na dahil doon okay so i guess yung ginawa nung um, axios uh, i think yun yung main company you know, who owns um, yung crypto kitties that was one of its i'm not sure kung subsidiary or like one of its parang uh, 
parang one of its uh, smaller companies ano yung Dapper Labs gumawa siya ng own platform niya na tiyatawag na Flow mm-hmm. so yung top shot na ngayon it's running on the Flow na I guess block parang platform no okay um uh, just to disclose no I'm not really uh, like a crypto expert or ano pero uh, I researched a bit no before uh, we invested on this so so as far as I recall parang yun yung history naman ko mm. so yeah. ito NFT na to so hindi pala to bago kasi 2017 ba kasi medyo ngayon lang natin na name ko lang naririnig yeah, ko yeah, yeah, NFTs yeah. eh yeah and unlike it's uh kasi parang ano rin to diba uh si- yung technology niya is similar to how cryptocurrencies work right yeah 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 so, so pero this one it's all about parang arts tama ba uh, uh so pwedeng arts pwedeng collectibles so yung one application na they see in the future yung mga album releases like instead uh-huh. na like yung physical o ano pwedeng through nft like mm-hmm. bibigyan ka ng token andun yung album ano okay. kasi be played on yung music ng artist o ano mm-hmm. uh, pwedeng daw gawin yun like sa mga concerts yeah. uh, like yung tickets instead na physical ticket like digital talaga doon ipapakita mo na lang um so parang everything digital na talaga yeah Pero, yeah parang uh, nba is it's, it's called moments tama ba it's called moments yeah moments moment yeah, how long it's moment. a moment usually how long can it be or how short siguro um ano ba jc mga f- maybe uh, around seconds? 10 seconds 10 seconds oh, yeah. yeah yeah mga 10 okay. seconds um, so para siyang moving trading cards para siyang instagram story Yep. Yeah, but it's yeah, tied yeah. up on a crypto blockchain. Yeah. Uh, okay. So parang yeah. everything is unique and authentic. Kaya siya mga may value. That's how I understand it. Kasi usually ang tinatanong ng mga mga nakarinig is uh, how can it be unique kung kanay na napapanood let's say in other channels. How how can paano ba, ano ba unique sa kanya? Like is there a serial number or something? Yeah. There is, there is. So, ah, okay. um, may mga tiers siya. So, mayroon mga legendary, uh, rare, common. Okay. So, yung mga legendary, one of 49 cards lang usually, or like one of 79 cards. So, yun yung mga, yung mga record sales, like yung mga, yung mga bumibenta ng mga uh, north of 100,000 or like 200,000. Usually, um, mostly legendary cards yun. Nila Lebron, USD. 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 100,000. Jamorant. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, Pero this, um, uh, when you say one of 49, there are just 49 of it. Tama ba? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah. So, okay. yung iba nagbabayad ng premium kung yung serial number ko is number one. Number mm-hmm. one of 49. O kaya kung nyari Lebron na moment, tapos yung serial number is 23. 23 yeah. of 49, ganyan, di ba? Jersey number. So, yeah, like yung mga tao nagbabayad ng premium for uh to get no yung mga ganung serial numbers so okay. minsan crazy talaga medyo okay, yung uh, kunya de ano yun sorry yung, 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 yung nag choppy ka bit kunya de nag choppy ka bit ano mark oh uh, uh, medyo crazy yung pricing may mga instances okay kunya de yung Steph Curry kunya de na normal na yung circulation count would be let's say 15,000 JC no yung base to na, na Steph Curry. Tapos mm. no, it would probably sell ngayon mga $280 yung common na yun. Mm. Siguro kung, kunyari kung makuni mo yung jersey number ni Steph Curry or yung first na ganon na moment, siguro you have to pay mga $20,000, $10,000 siguro. So, kailangan mo magbayad ng premium na uh, 30 times over okay. or uh, 60 times over. Ganon. Pero who, who's, who's setting the prices? Like sa market ba? Or auction so, siya? Or mm, yung, mar- yung market niya, para siyang eBay in a way, na kanya uh, lahat tayo, let's say, mayroon tayong uh, tig-isa na Lebron card na 149 lang. Uh-uh. Tapos, mag-post tayo ng price natin. Lahat doon. Okay. Yung unang papakita doon, 
yung priority na price is yung lowest price na posted. Okay. So yung lowest offer ng uh, mga sellers. Okay. Yeah. So, so we call that as Kumbaga, you... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Pero I would assume yung Dapper Labs, since most of the product, most of the moment, sila may ari. Uh, well, ito, hinala ko lang to, kaya hypothesis ko lang to. Baka siniset nila yung pricing. Uh, may mga actually, na they would set it, no? From Pero what ako, I read, from, from yeah. what I read, uh, NBA is part owner of this. Yeah, they are, yeah. So, it's uh, a partnership okay, be uh, between... Uh, the NBA, the NBA Players Association, yun, uh, and the uh, Dapper Labs. Yeah. So, so may cut yung players then, like may 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 parang profit sharing sila in a way, no? Mm, yun. Okay. Kaya I think ako ah, theory ko lang that is a big uh, parang detail that can really boost or hype the price of certain yeah, yeah. moments. Kasi pag nalaman nila it's an nba owned diba yeah, uh, yeah, product yeah, yeah. parang yeah. una it's legit already pangalawa yeah. the players are also in it so parang diba, easier yeah. for them to hype up everything yeah. diba parang even medyo medyo aligned yung goals ng mga stakeholders mm, like yeah, the nba oh. nbpa dapper labs like everyone like even kunya kung maging user ka bumili ka ng moment magiging aligned din eh, yung goal mo, which is for the community or for for the platform to grow, di ba? Yeah. Tsaka, may question na ako, yung sa ano, yung sa yeah. tiers, may legendary, di ba? Yun yung sabi nyo, parang 149, meron pang yeah, higher yeah. yan eh, di ba? Like, sa, sa cards kasi, like, pag may base card, tapos may special card, parang same lang yung picture. Parang, yeah. ba lang yung border or yung print yeah. yung print pero pagka pagka top shot ba yung video parehas lang pag legendary and yung common um parang may uh, outline no JC yes na parang it would make it appear like na parang hologram yung ah parang if you're familiar kunya with yung mga magic the gathering cards or like pokemon cards yeah, yeah. yung mga cards na parang flare or ano uh-huh. I guess parang yun yung in a way na parang translate nila yun yung equivalent ng mga flare na cards. No? Hindi, parang sa NBA cards siguro may mga patches, di ba? Pag may mga patches yeah, yan yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. or may signature. So it's, the same, it's the same video pero may, may parang may, may binago lang or may, uh, may enhancements. Yeah. Parang ganun. Um, we could show you screenshots later of uh-huh. yung mga differences. Kunyari may isang uh, lupa na moment na Let's say, it's a common lang, one of 3,500. Kunyari uh, yung game winner niya against uh, Clippers. Clippers. Uh, Clippers last year. Uh-huh. So may isang ganun, I think it would sell mga, ano ba, mga 5K for $1,800. Okay. Okay. Ngayon mga 3,800 3, 3, ngayon. Uh-huh. Uh, sorry, yeah, since baka nag-fluctuate yung price, baka mga 3,800 ngayon. Pero uh-huh. siguro yung uh, hologram or metallic nun, ano, mga... 50k JC, mga 60k. Grabe, laki ng um, ano yung difference. I'll, uh, okay. yeah. I'll check now para makik para ma we can uh, Pero laki ng difference noon. Yeah, like from 3k difference, to yeah. 50k. Yeah. Pero okay. So major hindi pa rin ako clear. So in the sense na okay, these are videos, 'di ba? Moments, these are yeah. videos. And Siguro it's the license or uh, yung code that makes it different, yeah. tama ba? Tama ba yung yeah. ko? It's a code that makes it different from, let's say, a YouTube video of that same moment. Kasi malamang sa YouTube, meron yan, eh, di ba? Yeah. Correct, correct. correct. Uh, I think yung question nyo lang is kung bakit siya, um, kung ano yung value na pinanghahawakan mo when you have that moment. Yeah. I think yun yung question nyo, no? Yeah, more on ganon, yes. Uh, well, oh. I think sa opinion ko, lahat to may value because yun nga, it's tied up on, you have to understand kung yung connection niya with the crypto blockchain mm. so parang, in a way parang lahat ng ito may value and as long as there are buyers and uh, sellers parang yun nga, lahat, lahat yun parang may use, parang may purpose, di ba? parang Minsan, you just want to be a collector. Minsan, gusto mo lang mag, um, mag-earn ng money from it. Diba? Iba-iba naman tayo ng uh, 
reasons. Purpose kung bakit tayo nagko-collect. Yeah. So, 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 yeah, I, I get that. Kasi sa trading, uh, like, alam, malamang ni Marvin, what drives the price is the supply and demand lang, di ba? If there are lots of demand, yeah. prices would really yeah. shoot up. Plus, add that, the marketing factor of the NBA, maybe, and the players as well. Talaga mag-shoot up yung prices. So, how do you uh, siguro start? How do you start? I mean, getting into this. Do? Like, um, uh, do you become a member or something? Um, so, so, una, you, uh, you sign up sa website nila and then you try uh, adding uh, dapper funds or minsan, you can use your crypto wallet. Mm-hmm. And then, yung uh, NBA Top Shot, they release packs para mga maybe once in two weeks. So, para most users, you they line up to uh, to get those packs. Just mm-hmm. from there, uh, so, uh, depending sa rarity, uh, so, uh, dumumaw po yung mga moments. Um, may mga, di- para nag-experiments na currently eh, sa mga okay. different type of queues. So, okay. may mga ibang types of queues before na parang first come, first serve. Okay. May mga different types of queues na pag nakapasok ako niya ah, uh, may certain time range, range kunya na 15 minute window na pag nakapasok ka doon magkakaroon ng raffle para eligible ka to join the raffle so kung makapa kung papili ka may chance ka to purchase mm. parang sobrang crazy yung idea no na uh. nagkaka-raffle or nag-queue ka sobrang tagal just to have the chance to purchase so i guess parang hindi naman crazy yung idea kasi Yung asawa yeah, ko like naglalaro ng Animal Crossing, pumipila siya for turnips. Yeah, yeah, matagal, yeah, yeah, diba? Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, I mean yeah, this is not yeah. even crazy. Yeah. Yun, crazier. Kasi parang, for me, parang, is ko, ano yung turnips, diba? Pipilahan mo. Ay, yeah. pang 49 yung, uh, ako, diba? Stock, stock exchange. Diba? So, <laughs> <laughs> so parang nung kinukwento mo yan, na ko I don't yeah. really find it crazy. Kasi parang, parang, yeah. Yung concept yeah. is been there for well, video games. Yeah. Okay. Parang ano, parang EC, di ba? Or, uh, yeah. Oh, yan. Ganun din. Well, well to me, actually, it's not crazy. Because uh, parang for like the past few years, we've seen people spending, kunyari, VC sa 2K, di ba? On virtual uh-huh. clothes, virtual yeah. shoes, di ba? Yeah. Tapos on mga tattoos, or ano, sleeves. <laughs> then, <laughs> uh, like si JC, di ba? Ba't ka na matawa-tawa, JC? Nag-2K kasi ako, guilty ako. Ako sa mga bumibili ng VC. Yeah, so, um, like sa Fortnite, di ba? Like, same din. Like, yeah. people would spend on skins, di ba? I guess in other games din, eh, di ba? And malaking like, factor oh, that, uh, di, yeah. di siya sabi mo, it, the packs are being released, ano, once every two weeks lang. Uh, well, it varies, eh. Parang you have, parang you really have to be... Pero it's not every na, day, right? It's right? not every day. It's not every day. So, ibig sabihin... Parang, yun, the, the parang supply kailangan is not... Kailangan makilig ka talaga dapat eh. Yeah. Like, kailangan uh, mag-follow ka sa Discord, sa Twitter nila, para updated ka uh, when the, the pack drops are. Kasi mm-hmm. kung hindi, like, uh, like, pumunta ka sa website every now and then, uh, and, uh, tingin ko unlikely, parang magiging less, uh, like, magiging unlikely na, unlikely na makabili ka ng pack drops eh. Na, na, mm-hmm. Sorry, unlikely na ha- na makapag-participate ka sa pack drops pala. Okay. So, yung yeah. pack drops is basically you it's parang diyan nagbubukas yung tindahan, parang ganon. Yeah. So, that's where you can buy ka, a pack. Yeah. So, yung yung pack uh to me, uh, yun yung best value for money. Kasi yeah. makabili ka ng pack na $9 ang laman ng cards. Tapos yung mm. cards, pwede ka magka-chance, makakuha ka ng Lebron James na card na 1 of 15,000 siya. Pero yung value niya is $1,400, di ba? So like may mga ganong, um, uh, may ganong swelte, may ganong swelte eh. Yeah. Mm. Parang, Kaya, parang makuha... NBA cards, di ba? Yung collect, co- if yeah, you yeah, collect. Yeah, yeah. Parang yung physical cards lang din. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Cheaper yung, yeah. if you buy it in pa, you get a chance yeah. to get Oh, pero like ang difference ng siguro yung yung NBA cards mas marami minsan yung laman, 'di ba? Uh, ang difference yeah, yeah, yeah. sa NBA cards, 
you can buy anytime you want basta may pera ka like yun like, isa pa yun yeah. here, okay, here okay, even okay. if you have money you have to be lucky in a sense or um, ask di ba parang ganun before you can get a pack may mga ibang types ng collectors what they do is they just buy mga well same with them with physical cards no they buy packs they don't open it tapos they sell it na unopened mm-hmm. ah para tapos misya. parang I guess I, I, I guess may parang market na like may market factors lang pinafollow or ano to decide kung ano yung selling price nila okay wait so, wait uh, you, a pack is nine dollars correct that's what you said yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Wait, standard okay, so yung price na yun? Is that standard? Uh, $9? It varies eh. Yan yung common for the common pack. $9. Okay. For a rare pack, siguro, siguro currently ah, yung mga rare 99. pack. $99. $99 USD? Yeah, so may mga cards, may chance kang makakuha. Sure, kung nakabili ka ng pack na ganun, sure may chance kang makakuha ng card na 1 to 500 lang. Tapos hmm. yung 1 to 500 card na yun, kung mapalo yung price, siguro ngayon sila Thomas Saturansky mga ano JC mga 600 700 mm. so in a way parang pag bumili ka ng uh, pack yeah. parang yung money mo alam mong para ka nag ROI and plus plus yeah yeah uh, parang siguro mga times 4 times 5 siguro same with physical cards um, yeah uh, hindi ako ganun ka certain na baka outdated yung ginagamit ko na metrics pero I think mga times 4 ata eh pag nakabili ka ng pack so, yung value of money So, kumbaga, basta nakabili ka ng pack, basically, medyo ROI. Yeah. Yes. So, kunyari, swelte ka talaga. Okay. Like, kunyari, nag-start ka ng October. Tapos, uh-huh. bili ka lang ng bilet through packs lang. Kasi, yung experience ko, when I started mga January, di ba, JC? Or nung mga, nung, kahit last month lang, February, di ba? Mm-hmm. Nag-join tayo ng pack drops. Guaranteed na kasali tayo. May mga instances pa nakabili tayo. Two na packs. Diba? Mm-hmm. O, ikaw ba? Yes. Eh ngayon, maraming instances na hindi kami na nabibili at all. Thank you. Yeah. Dahil sobrang dami na ng users. Yeah. Mm. Okay. How many users are there na ba ngayon? Like um 100,000. Well, yung sa- sabi nila, nila nila like mga 400,000 daw. Pero I'm not 400. sure kung 400,000 na nag-sign up lang kasi baka may mga iba na parang uh, in it lang to scalp na papasok lang. Oo. Oh join ng pack drops, magbibenta. Yeah. Kasi easy money, okay. di ba? Like, kunyari, kung maka... Yeah. Lalo na kunyari, lalo na kunyari, kung hologram, yung pack na yun is $999. Hmm. Tapos, bumibenta siya, like, mga $3,000, $4,000. So, kahit yung, di ba, kung nakabili ka nun, si benta mo, like, $3,000. Kita ka agad, like, $2,000. Oo, oh, oh, okay na yun. Di ba? Oo. Yeah. Eh, eh, yung mga iba pa, na. may isang time, na nagka-rare, ay, nagka-legendary pack drop yung NBA Top Shot. Tapos nagka-problema. Parang may mga iba na nakapasok diretso ng JC, di ba? Mm-hmm. Diba? Na, na-stock sa queue. Okay. Eh, yung mga iba nakapasok, siguro, like, mga scalpers lang talaga, like, nag-sign up lang. Hindi talaga collectors, nag-sign up lang just to to buy a pack and flip it after, no? Like, mm-hmm. like, like right uh-huh. after the pack drop. I think right now, so, yun, mga... Kasi the last queue we joined, uh, which was last week, may mga parang 150,000 users na nakalign up sa queue and more. Okay. Grabe. Okay. So, okay. Ilan, ilan lang ang mga kabili nun out of 150,000? Oo, oh, yun. Yung last time, parang ano lang, diba? 10,000. Yung last na rare pa, 10,000 lang. <laughs> Wala pang 10%. Yung mga, yeah, mga, mga, mga 11,000. 11,000, oh. Yung mga common, like, mas like, mga more chances. Yata. Yeah, kasi parang mga 5% chance lang eh for an average user to win like a uh, two ne, for an average user to get a chance to buy a pack so kami sa barkada namin ilan tayo JC mga anim tayo no na six yeah so initially kasi nagpool kami ng pera oh. tapos uh, individually nag uh, uh, like ini encourage ko sila na mag uh, venture sa top shot on their own mm-hmm. So, nag- so, ah, so may pool pera. of money kayo plus individual yeah, yeah, yeah. ano pa uh, yeah, pwede pa kayong yeah. kuha na lang rin kayo on your own para at least may chances so, yeah, yeah, parang yeah. practice you know, parang experience yeah. <laughs> pero yeah. okay Kasi, so mm-hmm. so if you buy nabagit mo kanina yung common pack that's easier to get right parang correct yeah 
mas marami yung pwedeng makakuha nun. Pero doon sa common pack na yun, you can get special moments rin. Like yung mga legendary uh, or hindi. So, no, pu- hindi, hindi. Very so, rare. You could get yung serial, yung serial number na maganda. So, kunyari, okay. pwede ka makakuha ng Steph Curry na, zero, na yung first na mente. Okay. Pero base lang yun, base card. Base, base, base card, base, yeah. Base yeah card. Pero, pero, pero yun, um, since yung pack nga is only $9, tapos you get three per pack, di ba? So parang $3 yung average cost mo per moment, di ba? Pero yung Steph Curry, kunyari ngayon, kung nakabili ka like a few weeks ago, ngayon, mga $280 na yun. Okay. So yung three dollars, yun, di ba yung $9 mo, parang kumita ka na agad yeah. like mga... Uh-huh. 30 times over or something. No? Okay, pero... Pero syempre, like, uh, hindi ganun lahat, di ba? Like, short yeah. game talaga. Y- yeah. May, Kasi yung sisay mo card na yun, eh. possible yun. One lang rin yun out of, di ba? Out of the many Steph Curry yeah. stuff, eh, di ba? Pero... Like yung one... Pero if you get a common pack for $9, for example, what are the average prices of the cards inside? Meron ba dyang... Uh, yung average lang not the not the special uh, ones so so ngayon kasi nagva-vary kasi nagva-fluctuate yung yung prices ng cards so just a few weeks ago kami ni JC na witness namin yung mga may, may mga cards as cheap as mga 1 to 2 dollars JC no yes like sila Maxi Kleber sila Tanases Antetokounmpo okay sila uh, so yung mga ganun they have Mother, value yeah. pero 1 to 2 dollars like yeah pero, like, pero like, like ako personally na rin eh. yeah like ako personally like uh hindi ko muna bibili mga ganun i'd rather yung mga future all stars yeah yung mga retiring yung mga, na players yung mga may potential na talaga yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yung mga cleaver wala naman ng potential yan eh. kung ano yung, what you what they are like, now since, most likely ganun rin sila yeah, every year na, yeah like diba? like nakikita ko lang potential for those uh, mga foreigners baka yung mga home country yung mga like mga fans nila from their country baka bumili o ano since nga 15,000 lang ano di ba so kunya like kayo like Clarkson si Clarkson for that time mga how much is mga 5 6 dollars no mm-hmm. mga thir- mga 38 to 40 dollars siya ngayon mm-hmm. alam tayo would be, would you guys be interested kunya rin bumili ng Clarkson na moment dati oh. parang y- yung sa group namin sa NBA Top Shot Philippines Medyo malaming bumibili ng Clarkson. Kasi nga... Kasi Pinoy. Yeah, Pinoy. Pinoy, di ba? Pati Correct. si Clarkson naglalo sa... sa Gilas, di ba? Or, yeah. or, or, or sa Philippine team. Yeah. So, like, I guess yun. Baka sa ibang countries, kunyari, like, kunyari, like, sa... like, si, si, like sa, sa, sa Slovenia, yung luka ng mga cards. Baka... Kirui. Mas magka... Japan. Yeah, yeah. Yung pa, yung pa, Japan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pero, Tapos si Rui pa, parang promising na rookie. Oo. Yeah. Ay, sorry, na sophomore, sophomore. Yeah. Curious na ako sa moments nila. Like, let's say, si Clarkson kasi meron, like si Kleber. Yung moments ba niya talaga is something exciting or parang wala lang, three points na, or lay up lang? Uh, <laughs> Ganun-ganun lang siya naman. I mean, ano ba yung sabihin na moment? Kailangan ba talaga very exciting moment? Yeah. Or wala lang, parang dunk lang. Yung kay, yung kay Kleber, nag inbound siya eh. <laughs> yun lang yun. Hindi, hindi, hindi. Hindi, hindi. Parang nag, nag, nag-alup si Luca. Uh-oh. Tapos, uh, kinuha ang dunk niya. Uh, so, medyo... Okay, okay wait. Itong moments na to, medyo magand- highlights talaga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. So, Or, ba, meron kasing... Block, tres. Hindi, pero, ito, serious question. Meron ba moments na tipong sumut lang? Yung nag-jump shot lang? Um, Three-point shot? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Unwari, so, Curry, ma- Curry or Carmelo, three-point shot with a dribble, of course. Uh, yeah, parang as much as possible, parang yung kinukuha nilang moments, kunyari parang uh, crucial yung game or close yung game. Tapos yung tres na na-make niya. Yeah, uh, na yung parang, crucial uh, shot. Medyo, uh, yeah, like parang go ahead or uh, game winner, ganyan. Pero may description, like may this description was the game winner. Yeah, meron, meron, meron. Okay. Uh, like may, uh, yeah. So, so uh, how yung, far back does it go? How far back does the moment um, go? So far, yung sa mga base sets, uh, as far as last season lang, yung, hmm. yung rookie, year nila, rookie year nila sa yun. Okay. Okay. Pero meron din silang, meron din silang uh, type ng uh, parang uh, edition na, na, na linabas 
ang tawag nila Run It Back Edition. Mm. So currently may mga may mga highlights nila Tim Duncan, Steve Nash, uh, meron yung diak na ni Man, Ginobili si Chris Bosh mm. nung finals nung 2014 na tayo. Yeah. Then parang nagse-sell yun for like 18 to 20,000 dollars. Uh 275 lang yung ganung moments. Maganda yung Kawhi moment yung versus Ah, yeah, meron yun. Ah, hindi, yun wala pa yun, wala pa yun. Yung buzzer yung, na Kawhi, meron kay Kawhi yung tinapal niya si Jamal Murray. Kasi from last ah, year lang eh. Ah, from last year. Hindi, yung okay. run it back, di ba? Yun yung maganda. Yung... Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Very um, yan, yan eh. This coming March ba, JC or April, magkakaroon it back daw ulit. Tapos kasama na sila Shaq, sila Allen Iverson, T-Mac. and si T-Mac. Yeah. So, balapit sana cool. kung yung kay... kay Kobe wala pa eh. Ah. Well, well, sana, well, sana yung kung yung kay siya. Baka ano pa yan. Baka medyo may mga discussions pa about using Kobe. Yeah, yeah. With yeah, Vanessa. Yeah, yeah. Parang very... <laughs> oh, hindi. Pero feeling ko kasi very protective si ano eh, si Vanessa. Yeah, ano, yeah. Ito, ito, ito. Sa legacy ni Kobe eh, di ba? Oh. Yeah. Pero, uh, okay. So, now, let's say you you bought a pack. Okay, you bought a pack. Nine dollars yung pinakamura, and then how nine 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 yung pinaka nine hundred ninety nine dollars yung pinakamura. Yeah. Ito yung legendary, yeah. di ba? Yung sabi niya legendary pack. Yes. Okay. And every pack has three, three para moments. Uh, um, nagbabaria. Yung alam ko yung yung legendary yung nine hundred ninety nine na pack. Ten ata yun eh. Okay, so marami rin. Okay, so yeah. Yung three is the common. Breakdown. Yeah, yeah, three yung common. Okay, okay. So, not, so yung sa rare pack, ah, parang five ata or six yung rare. Kasi yung mga rare, patay legendary, hindi pa kami na, nananal ni JC. Oh, so, hindi pa kami nakakawal yung ganyan pack. Hindi so. na-retain sa memory namin kung gano'ng kadami yung card. <laughs> <laughs> pero, pero sure yun na uh, rare agad na talaga more than 1,000 USD yung worth. Pero so, yung yeah. sinasabi niyong queues, you have to pick anong queue ka. Ganun ba yun? Um, Random yun. Random yun. Queue. Like, Tapos, kung ka sa common yeah. queue ka, uh, sa legendary queue. Ah, hindi, hindi. So, usually, once, pang per pack drop, either common lang lahat, or ah, pang okay, pack drop, okay. lahat, legendary lang lahat. Okay. Ganun siya mag, uh, usually. Okay, so now, when you queue, pumila ka na, and then you got in. Okay, now you got in. Yeah. Nakapasok ka. Uh, pag nakapasok ka, dapat sure bibili ka na. Or hindi rin. Uh, well, sa well ako personally parang sayang yung opportunity kung nakapasok ka na tapos you back out no. Uh, may uh, mga ibang well, oh. na parang yeah. Pero may, may mga ibang tao na parang I just want to try it out tingnan ko yeah. diba. Yeah yeah yeah. So kung may mga ganung uh, users ahead of you. So well tika kasi baka may chance makapasok ka pa sa queue. Mm-hmm. Outside ka sa like sa cap no or yeah. what. So, so um, pero pwede yun. If you got it, pwede, yeah, pwedeng yeah, wala kang pwede, bilhin. Pwede, pwede, pwede. Yeah. Like, may mga iba, kunyari, nakapasok sa queue, pero yung card, kunyari, nare-reject or nag-fail. Parang may 10 to 15 minutes lang. Uh, ilang minutes ba, JC, yung yung time they allot uh, for a user to purchase? Uh, actually, hindi, hindi ako sure dyan. Kasi pa nag-queue ako, talagang gusto kong bumili. Yeah. <laughs> I, so, I think lahat naman ng tao nag-queue gusto talaga bumili. Yeah, most likely naman, yeah. natanong ko lang yeah. kasi baka may iba. Yeah. They were just shopping, ara- window shopping lang muna, di ba? Hindi oh. muna bumili. Yeah. <laughs> Pero you use, ano, yeah. you use credit cards then para magbayad, tama ba? Ganun din? Um, Cryptocurrency yeah. or well, what do you use? So, we, we've tried both na. So, uh, okay. so far ha, since, uh, so far, kahit mas mahal yung parang mahal yung fixed cost ng card na 5% outright na charge. Kunyari, bumili ka kunyari ng card na worth uh, let's say $100. I-charge ka ng platform $5 for using a credit card. Ah. Pero yung sa cryptocurrency siguro kung wala kang mahanap na na less than 5% yung cost no for you to fund your account. Baka better to stick with the funding your account using a credit card. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Okay. okay. So, pwede so, rin yun. Okay. Yeah. So, so, so before, GC, pag, nag, pag nagpasok, nag-create ka ng account, you have to fund it immediately, right? 
Um, hindi para nabanggit yung Para pwede ka lang gumawa ng account. Pwede ka lang like, mag-browse, browse. On. Ah, okay. So, pwede lang. Ninyo. Tapos, okay. yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I guess, like, in like uh, with any venture, no? Like, may mga risks then involved. Yeah. Mm. So, I'd say currently, like, one of the issues na nakikita ko, may mga complaints online about yung withdrawal. Yung, yun, uh, yun, I guess, yun yung KYC up. process. KYC process for withdrawing funds. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm not sure. Baka hindi lang rin ako updated, no? Kasi hindi ko minimonitor like on a daily basis naman ito. Para may limit yung pag-withdraw, eh. I'm not mm-hmm. sure kung ano ba, JC? Mga $1,000 ba? O $1,500 yung withdrawal limit. Actually, hindi ko nga alam na may withdrawal limit. Pero it will take some yeah. time bago ka maka-withdraw. Pero yeah. you can. So, Matagal lang. Yes, but you can. But uh, And we know a lot of yeah. people na naka-withdraw. Well, um, okay. So, so yun, um, I guess yun yung one of the pain points now na madali magpasok uh, ng pera sa platform and uh, and like to buy and sell. Pero yung pag-withdraw, baka currently may delays pa. So, so aside from it being a platform where you can buy, it's also like a marketplace when you where you can trade. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, I think eventually, parang may plan sila to create a game eh. Na so, you game... Parang, ang pangalan nila parang NBA Hardcore. Nila yun. Okay. Yeah. I'm not sure lang how it would work, no? Pero may, may isang um, NFT na parang racing game. Ang ginagawa naman nila, parang mga... May trading cards ng mga car parts. Mm-hmm. Tapos gagamitin mo yung mga cards na yon ng mga car parts to create a car. So mag-racing kayo. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. okay. Then meron din yung uh, bago ngayon, yung Street Fighter. Yung Street mm-hmm. Fighter may non-fungible token na rin. Yun naman, mag-mix ka ng cards to create a uh, Street Fighter character. Mm-hmm. So the more cards okay. that you use like to create that character, mas parang magiging parang uh, rare or legendary yung So it's a yun. it's a another form of ano NFT. So hindi lang NBA top shot yung yeah. Uh, kind yeah. of N- NFT. So going back to your question uh Jerin. Um syempre alam naman natin na hindi lahat ng tao na ako ng pax eh, di ba? Since yeah. uh limited yung supply. So some people um pupunta na sila sa marketplace sometimes. Yeah. They just purchase this card so pag alam nilang tataas yung value or hindi, pwede silang i-sell or they can just hold on to it for a long period of period of time. Yeah. Uh, so, I think, parang ano eh, yung tingin ko dito, it's something, uh, kasi technology niya, like we said, pretty much similar to blockchain, blockchain technology siya. So, it's pretty much similar to how the cryptocurrency technology is, right? Pero ang difference nila, from what I see, is this becomes more exciting because it's more visual. It's, alam mo yun, it's for collectors eh. It's for, it's something, kasi yung sa crypto, it's like, parang ano lang siya eh. You trade because it correct, goes correct. up, pero really, you don't see anything. It doesn't really excite you mm. enough to say na, other than gusto mo lang kumita ng pera, pero uh, if you don't really understand it, Day, wala rin. Ito, even if you don't understand it too much, pero you just like to see you're visually, they're visually appealing. Gusto mo lang makita na you have this something Umen. na nakikita mo. Okay na eh. Di ba? Parang, Umen. pwede na rin. Di ba? And then, if you feel that you bought it in a price na hindi naman ganun kataas, na okay lang. Okay lang if I buy this at this price. Okay na rin. It's it's like a painting, eh, 'di ba? No parang yeah. Uh, uh, it can um, increase in value pero okay lang for me if I keep it. Yeah. Um in my opinion, yung um NBA Top Shot, it's like one of the first na ano ba to? Parang commercially yeah, no. viable na application yeah nung blockchain technology tapos yung partnership niya with the NBA parang uh, parang a, a global brand na mayroong humongous following globally 
like legitimizes it further no oh so, actually yun malaking factor talaga yeah. yun the like, NBA yeah, is behind like, it ako tingin ko but eh, i check then yung mga VCs yung mga venture capitalist firms na nag-invest sa sa Dapper Labs in the venture sa, sa top shot mga legitimate talaga na venture capitalists yeah well, well But well, in my opinion, in, 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 my, in my opinion. So, that, that makes sense. Yung mga iba din, siguro would uh, do their own uh, due diligence, no? their own research, no? Kasi syempre, like, uh, money yung nakataya, eh, di ba? Like, hindi naman free ito, ano? Yeah. Like, it's a venture, no? So, I suggest na if anyone is interested, no, to uh, try Top Shot, to read about it muna, no? Try to understand it. But, eh, Like kami nila JC no nag-usap kami, nag-usap kami before. Ang question ko sa kanila is um only put in money na you're willing uh, to lose kunya na kunya if you lose that money dapat mga two weeks one month hindi na masama yung loob mo like you'll get over it. So yun yung question ko sa kanila yeah. before uh we went uh yeah. to this venture no like yeah. um like how much are you willing to lose kasi ito yung mga cryptocurrency baka it's uh, at any time bigla mo pwedeng siyang, maglaho eh yeah para siyang alternative asset class eh na medyo volatile pa currently so uh sabi ko sa kanila baka may risk talaga na involved tapos so we have to manage it yeah and like i said any time pwedeng maglaho yan parang bigla na lang yeah yeah No wala yeah. na pala yung top shot na website, yeah, diba? yeah. I'm not saying yeah. it will happen, pero since <laughs> you don't yeah. have anything tangible that you're holding yeah. to say that you own it. Yeah. Diba? Parang Then, early on, diba? Like, uh, yung sa history ng mga cryptocurrency or ano, yung mga exchanges would get hacked. Uh, Mag-asala uh, na sila. Along with the funds of yung mga yung users, investors. No? Yeah. Oh, yeah, users. so... Tas, uh, I guess then, siguro nung time nung ano ba, 2016, 2017, nung maraming mga initial coin offering, yung mga yeah. maraming alternative coins na lumalabas, marami rin na, na talaga na illegitimate, na scam talaga. Yeah. So, And same, uh, same with this. Same, with, yeah, same no? thing so, with the NFT. Not, not just yeah, yeah, yeah. the top shot, pero yeah, I think so, it's more of the NFT uh, platform, yeah. ba tawag doon, platform or technology. NFT uh, in technology. So, if anyone na magupos ng money into it, you have to be cautious then, ano. You have to um, check then with yourself how much you're uh, willing to put in. Kasi may instances na nakakawili siya na minsan, di ba JC, parang mapabili ka ng dami kasi eh, no? parang may rush pag nakakabili ka. Tapos nun, makita mo yung binibili mo like after a few days, after a few weeks, nag-appreciate yung value para mas na-verify yung um, I guess biases mo or ano. Have, have so, you guys sold anything na uh, yeah, currently, like what we're bought doing and then sold it eventually for profit? We're cards. So, we're, uh, nag-flip lang kami. So, nag-start kami like yung mga common until maka bili kami ng mga mas rare na cards. So, you're flipping so, meaning you buy the common, you don't open it, parang gano'n. No, no, no. Again. Like, y- yung mga moments mismo. So, kunyari, bumili kami y- yung mga all-stars like sila Chris Paul, sila Zach Levine, Donovan Mitchell. Ay, hindi sa pa. Individually. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah like, binili namin. From the marketplace. Marketplace. Yeah, like, like oh. sila Steph Curry, Jamorant, Luka. Tapos nun, uh, pag nag-appreciate na yung price niya, binibenta namin. Okay. Tapos, uh, iniipon namin yung money na yon to buy more expensive cards. So, kunyari, bibili kami nung parang uh, rare na na Jamorant. Ganun. Using yung proceeds sa mga nagbenta namin na common na mga all-star players. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. So, so, so feasible so, naman din pala to buy those types of ano moments from all-star players. Kasi ang yeah, idea yeah. ko, parang it's gonna be difficult to buy um, from na um, players that are kilala na. Yeah. Um, well, yung hypothesis ko lang din ito, 
tingin ko yung company, yung Dapper Labs, they wouldn't uh, make it na mataas masyado yung cost ng mga cards for yeah. new users. Kasi kunyari, kung papasok yung new user, tapos yung price ng cards parang $50, $60. Wala na. Diba? So, kunyari, kung, kung bata Ayawan ka na. or ano, di ba? Parang unlikely na maging parang long time na user or fan ka of the product, di ba? Yeah. So, I guess, as the user base increases, yung circulation count ng mga cards, dadami din. Para to, para ma, para ma, para ma-push in a way, para ma-push ma down yung prices, no? Of those cards. Mm. So, yung mga earlier on cards na kunyari, one of 49 lang, one of 500 lang, it would be more rare, no? Kasi yung mga bago ngayon, like mga one of 25,000 na. Or ano? Ah, uh, okay. So, mm. Mahal na yung iba eh. Yeah. What's your so, ano, most expensive moment? Um, um, may nabili uh, kami earlier on. Sabi ko kasi yung best na bili natin na moment for me at our budget, no? NBA Finals na LeBron. Na, mm -hmm. like, eh, kasi yung moments ni LeBron na NBA Finals during the bubble. That's currently, it. dalawa lang siya. Ah, isa parang uh, isang rare, isang legendary. So at that time, binili namin siya like mga $3,700. Wow. Pero, pero, pero syempre, like, uh, nag-pull kami ng pera. Yeah, yeah. Kami hindi isang tao. Baka... Like, hindi lang isang tao to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Baka yeah, so, hunting yeah, ka mga... ng mga nakikita. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, marami kami <laughs> yung, yung mga high school classmates ko na na like na, na impressed with the technology no so yon currently yung lebron na yon same na, na card i think mga 17000 jc 16 17000 dollars currently can you flip it already time so time not yet not yet uh yon plan namin to hold on to it na matagal like mga siguro when lebron retires so ano or like so it's uh, an investment talaga <laughs> uh enshrined siya sa hall of fame so like, i guess same with physical we, cards Oh, I guess yeah, like could, when we, your, your advice would be LeBron. Kasi sa cards, ba? LeBron won't yeah, lose yeah, yeah. Is yeah, that Like, siguro thing? kami, baka yung top siguro, LeBron, Luka, Zion, Steph, uh, Ja, KD. Yanis. Uh, Pero ano, eh. Yanis, Yanis. Yeah. Yung Luka's physical cards kasi has been dropping, yung value. Ah, talaga? Uh, uh, is it the so, same thing with top shots? Mga well, ba, currently, medyo nag- nag shoot up pa currently. I guess kasi bago pa siya. Like, uh, uh, like, uh, last, like, a few months ago pa lang yung unang release. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, hindi pa bumaba yung value ni Luka sa top shots? Yeah. Ngayon, okay. yung, 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 yung lamello, yung, uh, yung lamello ball na rookie moment. Okay. Currently, one of 4,000 lang yung may ganun eh. Okay. Um, it's selling for mga $3,900. Wow. Yeah. Ano yun? Yung mga rare yun? Mga rare and legendary? Uh, like, common, uh, common yun. Supposedly common yun. Pero one of 4,000 lang. Tapos nun, kasi di ba since sila mellow ball, parang ngayon, parang everyone saying na rookie of the year na siya. Like uh, before, di ba medyo tight sila ni Halliburton. Mm -hmm. Pero yes. medyo, medyo ko... Ngayon, mukhang hindi na siya. Eh, ba? Yeah, mukhang, mukhang siya na eh, no? Hindi, hey, mukhang yeah. hindi na eh. Among hindi si sila mellow. Hindi ko si Halliburton pa eh. Ah, talaga. Gusto ko, gusto, uh, I guess kasi si, si Lamelo parang tingin siguro ng mga tao siya kasi yung stats niya like uh, 26-6, ganyan. Okay. Pero kunyari si Halliburton, ako personally, uh, gusto, gusto ko yung laro, yung off-ball na laro niya, uh -oh. yung outside threat, pati yeah. yung mga intangibles na binibring niya, pati yung defense, no? Pero... Hindi, mas ano kasi, um, mas hype si Lamelo, I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mas hype siya. Even if, si kahit sabi mo for, uh, parang kahit na hindi siya manalo ng Rookie of the Year, I think, eventually yeah, siya yeah. pa rin yung masikat eh. Yeah, yeah. Then, then, then Halliburton. Yeah. Parang si Luca, Luca, kahit naman hindi siya manalo MVP, sikat pa rin naman siya eh. Yeah. Over, say, MBE, for example, let's say nanalo si MBE the MVP this year. Most likely, the moments ni Luca would sell higher than MBE. Yeah, yeah. Diba? Like uh, same then kunyari like sila Kuzma or ano. 
like yung mga players na popular sa social media, uh, I would assume parang same din with top shot. Eh. Kunyari, kahit, let's say, si Mikal Bridges, kunyari, of the Suns. Baka, like kung, kung like fantasy sports fan ka, you'd see more value kay Mikal Bridges no, than mm. uh, Kuzma. Uh-oh. Pero kunyari, kung yung uh, fan ka, kunyari, na like, uh, like, like kunyari, parang fan ka na Like casual si fan lang, casual fan. Yeah, yeah. Like, Hindi mo kailala si Michael Bridges. Yeah, yeah. Kailala yeah. mo si Kuzma. So, so kasi si Kuzma nakikita mo sa mga TMZ or what, di ba? Oh. Like, oh. like sa mga gossip websites or what. Oh. So, oh. Para, like for like, parang more normal fan. Si Kuzma yung mas isipin lang valuable. Yeah. Pero like, kunyata yung mga uh, um, na hardcore, well, like yung mga fan, like fantasy, I'd say mga oh. hardcore fans. Yeah. would see more value kay Michael Bridges. Na, yes, yes. Mga ganun type. Tama, tama. Like, kasi parang ngayon sila Michael Bridges, medyo hindi mataas yung value, mababa yung value eh. Like sila Brogdon. Uh, yung mga boring players yan eh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mga, like, you won't mga, find them to be exciting. Yeah, pero effective. Like sila Drew. Uh, yeah. uh, Kaling uh, niya, yeah. hindi, pero, yung game kanina. Okay, so effective yeah. sila, pero from the top shot point of view, Are well, they guess, worth like, uh, better or buy low ba yan and eventually would or ganun na talaga yung value ng top shots nila? Uh, ako, or moments it's hard nila. for me to say. Eh. Like kunyari si Drew Holiday. Yeah. Diba? Like we know si Drew Holiday respected sa league na gritty defender. Tapos parang uh, parang kalmado na presence kunyari sa offense. Ganyan, diba? Yeah. Pero currently, currently sa top shot parang hindi ganun ka Like, yun mas mataas pa yung value ni Caruso, eh. Yun nga, eh. So, like, yung mga ganun, eh. Like, uh, like to me, parang medyo puzzling siya. Pero siguro, baka, mas marami talaga yung Caruso fans. Dahil, parang medyo, parang... Kasi hindi talaga, ano, eh. Parang, so, wala sila ng... Si Caruso. Oo, oh, hindi sila, yeah, hindi yeah. sila exciting enough. Both yeah. within the court and outside and of the court. Bent. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oo, oh, yeah. parang ganun. Pero sa yeah. NBA cards ba, Eric, yung mga Drew, higher value ba yan than, let's say, a Caruso card? Or equally, wala silang value? Hindi <laughs> naman. May mga collectors ni Caruso, eh, actually. May, oh, may mga see, collectors yeah. ni Caruso. Pero <laughs> yung Drew malamang, mas konti collectors. Mas konti. No? Oo, mas oh, konti. Diba? So, I guess, yung parang yung collector ni Caruso. Pa, medyo kaiba, no? Kasi kung yan, si Drew, that explains it, actually. That yeah. explains it. Yung mas, mas maraming collectors kasi si Caruso for yeah. the reason that kaya mas mataas yung value ng price and yeah. niya, ng moments niya yeah. and cards niya kasi mas maraming yeah. demand eh. Yeah, like kami nila JC for a time puro mga Lakers lang na moments binibili namin kasi Laker fans pa kaya? Namin, uh, well, currently kasi nandun si Lebron eh. Ah, okay. Lebron so Lebron fans. fans. Yeah, okay, Lebron okay. fans kami, yeah. So, pero yung, yung hula namin, Lakers parang one of the like most na known franchises no across all sports globally yeah so baka baka mas marami sa top shot na fans no actually yes most yeah, like bigger like, yeah. pool mga lebron anthony davis um <laughs> na mga moments no so very next talk up kami on that mm-hmm. yeah yeah make make sense make yeah. sense tama Pero tama maganda diba, din ano, strategy ba, may, kasi diba may rookie cards sa cards sa... yeah Meron yeah, ba yeah. pa dito, eventually? May ganun ba? Yeah. So ba? Yeah, yeah, rookie rookie moments. Yeah, yung lamelo yung sinasabi niya. Say, kaya nga, will yeah, that be yung... more valuable? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Kasi magkakabadges eh. Ah. Like, magkakabadge parang rookie first moment in top shot. Okay. Uh, first uh, rookie okay, moment. Okay, moment. Oo. Tapos nun, uh, rookie card. So, parang okay. tri- may triple badges, kunyari, for a rookie. Tapos yung mga yung mga challenges na nakikita ko it's like you collect the certain card ganun tapos you collect the, yeah, uh, the challenge yeah so so kunyari um you need to collect mga 10 cards or 12 cards Uh-oh. tapos in return you get a card na special so um last month may tinatawag sila parang cool cats challenge oh nakita ko nga i guess parang nod yun to crypto kitties yung parang first na nft venture nila Uh-oh. Um, parang kailangan mo mag-collect ng, I think, 10 cards yon Limang Uh-oh. cards doon, parang Cool Cats. Sila Devin Booker. Cool Cats Edition. Yung, 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 yung tawag. 
may cool no, cast addition na card parang ganoon. Yeah. Correct, correct. John Collins. Okay. Gets. Um Tobias Harris. Parang sa NBA Harris. cards din 'yun, 'di ba? May yeah. certain collections na uh, yeah. makukuha mo, 'di ba? Once you complete the collection, ibibigyan ka nung top shot nung extra card. So mm. yung binigay nilang card Luka Doncic. Oy. Tapos yung Luka Initially, yung value ng card yun, mga $600-$700. Okay. Tumaas siya as high as $8,000. Tapos currently, mga $6,000-$7,000 yung value niya. So, may mga ganong... Um, so, kalahan mo lang i-collect tayong sampung cards and you're gonna get the Luka card? Yes. Yeah, pero kasi yung cost ng sampung cards na yun, um, yung pinaka-recent na cool cats sa challenge, I think you need to shell out mga... Three thousand dollars, four thousand dollars, no, to, uh, to, okay. to buy all the cards. De- yeah. So <laughs> easy, so, and Eric. Eh, so gusto ko lang yare. Ay, yung sa collection pala sa pag-collect ng mga challenges. So parang, di ba you have to collect ah uh, ten cards, five uh-huh. cards don. Kailangan cool cut series, tama? Uh-huh. Yung mga five cards don, yun yung mga hindi masadong uh, popular na cards. So, yeah. so yung connection doon, oh, lahat ng cards may use talaga. Yeah. So, so kanoan, parang, yari, ano, sa Toranski, yung sinabi nyo kanina, parang gano'n. Yeah. Oh, so, yung sa, minsan, yung sa last, uh, Eric Bledsoe cool or Eric Bledsoe, favorite natin yan. McConnell, <laughs> Stanley Johnson. So, for a time, tumaas yung value niya. Dahil maraming tao gusto mag-complete uh, ang challenge. Yeah. Yung nangyari, yung Will Barton, oh. tumaas yun as high as $300. Kasi after the challenge, kasi kailangan... Kasi marami naghahanap eh. Kailangan nila i-collect yeah, yun. Yeah, yeah di ba? Oh. Tapos after the challenge, sobrang nag-plummet. Siguro mga $20, $30 na lang. So imagine, Parang, nga, kung bumili ka, $300. Tapos ngayon, $30, $20 na lang. So may chance na matalo ka, di ba? May mga risks talaga. Parang stocks din eh. Na, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, so pwede ka paglaruan. Mga, pwede mo paglaruan yung ano yung value nung ano, isang card na hindi siya, 'di ba, sa stock lang, small cap lang, mga yeah. Oh, yeah, mga yeah, maliliit yeah. na companies lang 'yan, yung mga Will yeah. Barton, maliliit lang 'yan. So, mabilis 'yan paangatin. <laughs> yeah. 'Di ba? Yeah, yeah. Tsaka pa bagsakin. Yeah. Diba? Yung mga <laughs> luka, mabilis paangatin pero mas mabagal bumagsak kasi yeah. ano, parang yeah, correct. Kasi ano mga tao eh. Oh, kasi gusto pa diba? gusto talaga ng mga tao eh, 'di ba? Pero maganda to together yung mga cards niyo to complete the challenge. Like is that um, against the rules or hindi ba? Well, initially, so uh, talaga uh, Eric Pinoy na, na Pinoy ka, hinahanap eh. yeah, yeah, yeah. mo pa ng loop. Eh, kasi mahirap eh. No, no, no. Ah, and actually kami yung ginagawa namin. Oh, si. Uh, <laughs> pero para naglabas ng advisory yung website na yung Dapper Labs na did discourage nila 'yon. Bakit? Na parang manually pina-flag nung um, system nila yung mga ganun, yung magawa ng ganun. Tapos noon, um, like manually nila ina-unflag. Kasi Pero how will they check? How will they know? Hindi naman din naman alaman eh, di ba? Para either i-email ka nila or i-freeze ka. Well, ako, I'm not really sure. Ah. Pero kami, since yung previous challenges, um, Parang yun yung ginawa namin eh. Kasi di ba, magbabalkada nga kami. Tapos noon, ayaw naman namin na mag-shell out on our own na, like, Or imagine one, parang, uh, yung... like, imagine like, like, parang anim na tao kami, mag-shell out kami, like, $3,000 each, just to complete the challenge noon. Yeah, oh. Well, kami, mas gusto namin na, yun nga, yung pooled resources para pa-distribute yung risk. Mm, okay. So, well, well, well ngayon, uh, baka, mas ma-discourage kami gawin yun kasi nga, nag-advise yung top shot na uh, hindi sila, like, hindi like, question nila, ko, paano malalaman ng top shot na ginawa niyo yun? Like, hindi ba niya point? Napinul niyo, hindi niyo naman niya malalaman eh. Um, I think kasi yung, yung history na, kasi, aside from buying and selling, one way na mag-transfer ka nung moments or nung cards is through gifting. Parang mm-hmm. i-gift mo, ibibigay mo lang. So Pwede kami, okay. yeah, parang may, kunyari, like, uh, Last week lang, may challenge sila. The gift challenge. Lahat ng mga users, like nung a certain point, kunyari, nung, nung February, binigyan nila, nila ng isang 
uh, free na top shot moment. So lima yon either Donovan Mitchell, D'Angelo Russell, Rui, uh, Jimmy Butler, pati si Jay McCollum. Pag makompleto mo all five cards na yon, bibigyan ka ng Derrick Rose na New York card, yung debut niya against Miami Heat. May free na ganung moment. So kami, since madami nga kami, noong time na yun, apat kami sa barkada na may accounts. Na, nakuha namin, three of the five na. Yung isa kasi, uh, same sila, pareho makolom. So three of five na. So, so sinabi namin, isang tao na lang magkukumpleto. Tapos yung dalawa, bibili na lang namin sa sa website para makumpleto yung five. Hmm. Nakumpleto um, niya. Nakumpleto namin. Pero yun nga, parang at what cost nga, parang natakot. Natakot kami ngayon na baka ma-flag kami. Hindi, <laughs> 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 pero ano ah, magaling yan ah. I think, uh... yun nga eh, like, gusto ko sila email eh, yung Dapper Labs. Like, anong, like, wala namang mali ginawa namin. Like, instead na Hindi ko pa naman na-flag eh. So, huwag mo na sila email. Baka ah, yeah, 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 defensive yeah, yeah, yeah. kayo masyado. Hindi. <laughs> 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 Hindi, pero... Next, yeah, yeah, you were saying. Sige. Yeah. No. May mga instances kasi na yung, yung, yung transactions na ginagawa namin, mukhang bot activity. Kasi kung nyari, may gusto kami bilhin na card. Mag-attempt kami mga 15, 20 times para bilhin yung card na yun. Power uh-huh. ulit. Kasi minsan kasi, nag-fail talaga. Like, may naunang nakakabili sa'yo. Kasi, uh-huh. So, ayaw mag-register yung transaction, di ba? Uh, so kami may mga instances na mga 10 times, 15 times nag-fail. Akala nung system nila, bot kami. Kasi ba't ka bilhin ng, bilhin ng 15 times, 20 times straight? Uh, yeah, pero so, it was a bug in the system. Hindi, pero kami, legitimate lang sa akin ginagawa namin. We're really trying to buy that moment. Uh, it just so happens na lagi kami naubusan. Kasi maraming ibang bumibili during uh, that time. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So... Yun, actually, ano, ano, Eric, gagawa niya si Eric, gumagawa niya ng account. Hindi, <laughs> gumawa na ako actually. Hindi, hindi, I oh, was wow, waiting wow. for this episode lang para medyo mas yeah. maalam kong gagawin ko. Pero, Join us, na like, follow our Facebook page. Sobrang informative ng Facebook page na. Oo. Yung, yung goal kasi namin sa Facebook page namin, sa NBA Top Rots Philippines, the same way na yung mga na uno na sa amin, like sila Sir Lucky, Sir X, si Miss Jeline, um, na tinuluan kami when we first started. No, sa Wait, these are Filipinos rin? Yung uh, sinasabi mo? Like, yeah, yeah. Like, Filipinos sila, pero some of them are not based here sa Philippines. Ah, so, okay. Okay, okay. Yeah, so, so, when we started, sila yung parang nag-guide sa amin, nag-onboard sa amin, nag-tool sa amin ng mga discalte. Um, so, parang kami nila JC para it's our way of paying it forward no yeah na yung group na share namin, share yung knowledge we try to be inclusive no parang we try to parang help mga new users na mm-hmm. to be onboarded na as fast as possible para kunyari yung mga mistakes na na na, na gawa namin earlier on ma-avoid nila yes yes yeah yes. kami ni JC may interesting story kami nag-scam <laughs> kami for mga <laughs> na scam kami for mga .80ETH na ibigay <laughs> kasi we were trying to buy a holo pack outside the market uh, <laughs> so yeah. meron din ganun yeah may ganun may ganun so yun the experience namin yun na, na scam kami medyo mga a few days like wala pang mga isang buwan to JC no wala pa wala pa yeah yeah so yun, pa, like, pa, pa, yun, how can you buy outside the market? Diba dapat sa platform nyo lang yun? Kasi pwede kasi through gifting eh, diba? So kunyari, pwede gawin, babayaran kita outside the market, mag-transfer ako sa'yo ng cryptocurrency, in return, i-gift mo sa akin yung mga, yung contents ng pack na yun. So kunyari, kung yung pack has like six na moments, all six na yun, mag-zoom call tayo ideally, open mo yung pack. Once ma-verify, i-gift mo sa amin. Okay. Ang nangyari, may, may parang brokerage service kami na kinuha sa Discord. May nag-pretend to be that broker, ginaya yung screenshot, yung name. Mm. At that time, medyo bago pa kami sa Discord, medyo noob pa kami. <laughs> Hindi namin alam na may parang unique identifier yung each yung user sa subscribe. Ah, okay. So, hindi namin na-check yun. So, <laughs> so yun. Well, well, since then naman, 
um uh, parang it's a difficult lesson ano well since then we try to learn from it na lang try to grow from it na lang uh uh-huh. okay. like instead na magdwell kami like ma depress kami ano <laughs> wala learning charge to experience sa yeah, yeah, yeah. charge to experience yeah. Oh, yeah, kaya kami kumuha ng group para i-guide yung mga yeah. mga new users uh, diba? to create yeah, like, a non-toxic avoid yung mga, like, community. Mga, ma-avoid yung mga stupid na errors or mistakes no? yeah. na we made when we started. Yeah, so, like the same way din na yung mga nauna sa amin nga guided us. Uh, so, yun. Uh, so, yun guys. I mean, I think, I think eventually later on we might, you know, invite Sina Marvin and JC back to give us give us an update or yeah, si Eric yeah. baka papasok na rin yan eh, di ba? Pero yeah, I think this is very interesting kasi nga uh, maganda na nakikita ko dito one is that they may gamification eh. Yeah. Uh, they they control it eh. Well, it can be a good and a bad thing. They control it. So, they can decide kung ano ito eh, parang Um, sila yung may hawak nung bone tapos ikaw yung dog, di ba? I mean, one way to look at it kasi control ni NBA everything, di ba? Yeah. And that can also be a benefit for you in the sense that if you get certain moments that have good value, pwede masel mo, you can earn from it, di ba? So, yun rin naman yeah. yung advantage if you do it wisely, I guess. Diba? And yeah. worse comes to worse, if you don't sell it, you have that moment. Yeah, meron kang uh, GIF na may serial number. Oh. Uh, you can proudly claim na you own. Oh, di ba? So, I think, ano, I, oh, medyo promising, medyo promising. I, yeah. I can't really say na if it's good or bad, pero yeah. medyo promising siya. And it's more exciting than uh, the crypto nga, na, the cryptocurrency na under the blockchain technology rin, di ba? So, ma- yeah. I think we'll, ako, parang... Pag kinukwento nila Marvin and JC, parang medyo interesting yun, ha? You collect, kailangan mo i-collect, tapos to get another card, di ba? Pero doon ko yeah. rin na-realize na parang you're in a leash already kasi <laughs> you'll try to collect and then ito yung yeah. reward mo, di ba? Sit ka dyan, tapos ito yung reward yeah. mo, di ba? Pero if you think about it, maganda nga rin naman yun kasi it yeah. allows everyone to not just stand still and wait, but you know, do things na that can really yeah. move the market and then uh, mas, mas shoot up yung mga prices ng mga, ng mga cards. So, para may action din. So, guys, ano yung group nyo? Just to be, ano, we'll, we'll uh, link it naman, pero can you uh, give the name of the group that they can join in? Uh, NBA uh, Top Shot Philippines. Yun, NBA Top Shot Philippines. So, if you're listening here and you want to Explore. Wala naman kailangan gawin eh. Just join in, see what's there. Uh, may mga announcements of, nakita ko may mga announcements of when the packs are going to be in. But drop. Yeah. Diba? Correct. So, yeah. Uh, kasi nga eh, very rare din yung, well, hindi man very rare, pero hindi siya regular drops. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. uh, it's in, it's maganda rin to find out and know when would be the drop. Para at least you can experience or explore uh, if you want wow. to. Alright? So, Uh, yun, join the group nila Marvin and JC. Uh, Marvin and JC, so, sobrang thank, thank you for ano, yeah. joining us. Uh, kahit na medyo short notice ng ano, konti. And uh, hopefully, next time we get to we get a chance to ano, uh, get you again to talk more about Top Shot. Kasi parang feeling ko we're just scratching the surface. Eh. Parang wala pa yung mm-hmm. yeah. very yeah, next, detailed. Uh, pa, it's a long game. It's a long game. <laughs> Uh, tingin namin baby pa baby pa yung technology eh. like it's on it, it's in its infancy stage pa like oh, parang like this yung, was uh, yeah, bitcoin like applications 10 years ago siguro parang ganun Five, actually they uh, say it's the bitcoin of nba <laughs> yun no di ba well, uh, hopefully 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 <laughs> uh, yeah, fingers crossed no so tingnan natin where this goes pero yun you can start exploring sabi nga nila you can start exploring now para at least when it, you know, nag, nag-traction na yan, uh, yeah. ano, sakay ka na. Hindi ka iwan. Yeah, like, diba? like uh, currently, no? Like, if yung number of uh, enrolled users lang, 
siguro mga 400,000 siguro siya currently. Pero mm. if you compare it kunyari no sa user base ng mga Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, 'di ba? Like yung mga 'yon, ilan users doon? Billions, 'di ba? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So if you can just imagine kunyari if yung top shot reaches kunyari 10 million users. Tapos meron kang card na 149 lang. 'Di ba? So yeah. parang may, parang scarce eh. Parang scarce yung item na 'yon. Like So I think yun yun doon yun yung magda-drive eh nung yeah. prices. Nung, yeah, tama. Nung, nung ganun, yung scarcity factor. Yeah. Pati yung madami kasi legal sa speculation eh. Like sino yung player yung pwedeng gumaling, yeah. maging uh, MVP or like si Ano rin eh, may parang chamba rin eh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kasi hindi like, mo rin alam, eh, 'di ba? Yeah, sabi ko kay JC, worst case uh yung venture natin dito sa, dito sa top shot. Ginawa lang nitong mas exciting in 2021 natin. Kasi kung yare kung if we didn't go if we didn't invest in top shot, like any investment namin, same old yung mga stocks, 'di ba? Yeah. Uh, like mga or kung like whatever na business ano. At least to kasi kami ni JST para mga long time NBA fans kami. Uh, uh, tung investment namin to eh, like sa NBA na yeah. like well, hindi man naga IPO yung NBA or ano like no so like yun yung yung investment namin is aligned with the uh, the goals of the NBA, the NBPA and yun that perhaps. Oh. Uh, so yeah. so yun guys, jo- join their group and you know, we'll link it in the description ng, ng wherever this will be posted itong podcast na to. so yun guys medyo again as yeah. always masarap na kwentuhan uh, very informative kakaiba rin kasi it's not really basketball in the sense na yung real game of basketball but it's a different aspect yeah. of the NBA and basketball so really interesting to know more about alright So thank you uh, JC and Marvin. Thank you Jeremy. Uh, thank, so, you, thank you sir. Thank you sir Jeremy and Alex. So, so, thanks for having us. So yun that's yeah. it for this episode of Fantasy Bench Warmers. Again, we'll, we have uh, watch out we have uh, episodes coming up kahit wala kaming quickie we'll have episodes coming up during the All-Star break. Uh, like we said, we nice lang namin yung scheduling of some of the guests. And uh, live session, I think, mga medyo confirm na live Q&A Tuesday yata, eh, no? Well, yeah. basta we'll post it, we'll post it, alright? We'll see you again uh, tomorrow. Hindi ko alam mo when, eh. Basta we'll post na lang namin. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye-bye.